Hey my loves and welcome back to my channel and welcome back for a brand new video. I feel like I'm a little bit ashamed to admit, well you know already, but today we have a H&M haul again and I just cannot stop shopping on there. If there is a place you need to shop, it's H&M. Honestly, they are unreal. In my opinion, they're overtaking Zara for me at the minute. I am just obsessed. I feel like the prices are really reasonable. The quality is chef's kiss. It's just so good and they have all the cozy autumnal pieces that you need for your wardrobe so i'm just finishing off my drink of choice yes it's chai latte i need a bit more originality well that is me being original to be fair because this is my favorite drink but i feel like i need some variation is what i'm trying to say so you might be pleased to know the haul isn't just neutrals it's not just creams and beiges we have got some darker, earthier tones as well. So the first part of the haul is going to be all your beautiful browns, taupes, grey, black. And then the second part of the haul is going to be more creamy tones and some lighter greys as well. I love this haul. I just, yeah, really happy with what I found on there. Everything will be linked down below for you guys to check out. And for size reference, I bought everything in a size medium and I'm loving how that is fitting on me. I am a 10 to 12. This time of the year, you want everything just to be super slouchy, really comfy, cozy, and just, yeah. I'm gonna begin with this dress. Now, when it arrived, I was like, oh, a bit boring. And I popped it on and I just fell in love. This is a gorgeous little black dress. And this is one that you certainly need as just a staple for your autumn winter wardrobe. So the first thing about this is it's ribbed fabric, which I love. A ribbed fabric is just gorgeous. It really elevates an outfit. It just makes it look more expensive. It's thicker. It's soft. We love a ribbed fabric around here. And the neckline on this one is what sold it to me so it's actually got quite a high neckline and then the back has a slight scoop there and it's just so nice another thing i adore about this is the sleeves it has really wide sleeves and they're nice and long so it covers your hands i love things covering my hands as you can see you just feel really cozy and you can really style this up and down it's just yeah the perfect item i think i love it so much i definitely recommend you get this Everything will be linked down below for you guys to so check out, by the way, if you're interested in purchasing any of the items. You would have seen me style that dress with this belt, and I love this belt. So I got this in a size medium. It is the most stunning brown colour. I love it. It's a beautiful chocolate. And I love how you've got the two belts in one. So you have this chunky one, and then you have the skinnier on the top. And you've got this brushed gold hardware as well. This really, really cinches you. Like you can really snatch your waist with this. I think it's because it's the double belt too. It kind of just really pulls you in. You can really make a statement with this. And it's giving like designer. I'm not sure what designer. But it wouldn't surprise me if someone told me this was like £300 from somewhere. I really want to find a matching pair of boots. Because I think wearing this with the matching boots will just tie an outfit together and look just insane. Next we have this gorgeous cardigan and this is just so so soft i love little cardigans and i might actually do a styling little reel on my instagram so do go follow me on instagram if you don't already and tiktok um yeah i'm thinking of doing a styling reel because there are so many ways you can wear a cardigan you can wear them buttoned up but as a top Obviously, you can wear them open. You could chuck them over your shoulders, that sort of trend as well. You can wear them back to front, so we can have a jumper with like a nice back detailing out of this as well. There are just so many ways you can style these. They're perfect for those days like today, where the sun is out, it's kind of crisp, but it's not cold. This will just be perfect because it takes the chill off, but you're not gonna be too hot and sweaty in this. So I really like this one. I think the color is absolutely gorgeous as well. It's like a mockery, it's sort of taupey shade, really pretty. It's got a slight mole sort of of colouring to it like it's kind of different colours as you can see and this is incredibly incredibly soft honestly unreal i then went for this really chunky knitted dress and i really love the color of this one again it's that mockery chocolate color which is just one of my favorite colors this season i love anything brown as you can see i love brown i think it's so beautiful and this is like the lighter version of brown in my eyes like you have this beautiful shade that you start with then you have this like warmy sort of shade then you go on to the chocolate browns i just love brown it's such a beautiful spectrum of colors <laughs> um but yeah i got this dress and again it's got that kind of mull sort of texture to it as you can see it's got like different sort of colors that run throughout it it's a nice wide rib you've got a soft neckline and it kind of just is straight down the length of this one on me was a little bit too long um just because 
because where I'm five foot three, I kind of felt like it drowned me a little bit. So you will see on the trial clips, I kind of held it up and I think it did look better when I did that. I stole this with that belt and some black boots. If the boots matched the belt, it would have been a look, I think. But I think it looked a little bit off because I had black boots, not brown. This is lovely. It's really soft. It's going to keep you really nice and warm. Nice long sleeves, really wide and just really really cozy perfect for a really cold day i think this would also look really nice with a little leather jacket as well i then got the same dress as the black one but in this nice charcoal gray color i really am stepping into my gray era this autumn it's not really a color i've worn much of before but yeah i do really love it and yeah just the same as the last one the wide sleeves which is just the bit that sells it to me and that gorgeous high neckline as well i think it's really flattering I can be a bit funny with necklines and what I think suits me and what doesn't because I do feel like my shoulders are a little bit more broad and where my chest is bigger, I just, I don't know, sometimes I just feel a bit like, mm, you know, weird with certain necklines and it just doesn't look cute. Whereas this sort of neckline I think was really flattering. And then that is the back of this one. Yeah, I love these. I'm not sure I'll be keeping this one. So I don't think I'll get as much wear out of it, but I'm definitely keeping the black one. Next, we have the top I'm wearing. So there's quite a few more of these later on in the haul, but I am just obsessed with this range that H&M have. So they basically have body suits and also tops. They've got them in cotton or they've got them in slinky fabric and they are just unreal so there's quite a few different necklines they have um and yeah as i say they have like the normal tops or the body suits i just love them i feel like i've got a majority of the collection now because these are my staples like i live in tops like this i really do so this one is the slinky fabric you'll probably see it's got a slight shine to it it's really stretchy as well not see-through at all it's got built-in not cups it's got an extra bit here so if you didn't want to wear a bra you're not going to see anything through it i love the neckline on this one it's nice and high and it's really soft really stretchy very very comfortable giving skim sort of dupe i am obsessed and the color of this as well is just beautiful i went for this little sweater and this is a beautiful shade of brown this is like stunning rich chocolatey sort of red undertone color which i love this one says poscana Firenze. I'm not very good with pronounced things guys but yeah this is what it looks like it's got stitching on it which is the same color which is gorgeous and i wasn't in love with this but it was all right it was all right i probably could have styled it a little bit better probably would have gone up a size in this one because i think if this was really just nice and oversized worn with some leggings and trainers or leggings and uggs i think that would be a really nice just casual look that you can lounge around the house in and still go out run errands etc and still look cute the quality of these is lovely they're really soft they're soft and fleecy inside as well, but they're not too thick and heavy. So perfect for that in-between weather stage that we're currently experiencing. Then I got these faux leather trousers. And as you can see, they're just skinny. And then they've got this stitching down the front, which I do like. I think it adds just a little something to it. Personally, I would only wear these if you're bum and that is covered i think these with like a nice long jumper would look really nice but i don't think they're flattering enough around the waist just because they're leggings like at the end of the day they're just leggings there's no shape around your bum it kind of just merges into one um so i think these are a perfect layering piece to wear underneath the jumpers um, but i styled this i believe with the cardigan which i wouldn't wear out like that i wouldn't unless i had a coat on but yeah I do really like these they're nice quality they don't make you hot and sweaty like some leather leggings can be really a little bit overbearing like you put them on and you're just absolutely sweltering these do have like a felt inside that's really soft but i didn't take them off and have like sweaty legs which has happened before sounds gross but it's true if you know what i mean you know what i mean <laughs> i think this is beautiful and this is definitely screaming christmas we love her she's gorgeous this is a lovely color gray i love the shade and it's just the design that sold this to me. So it's got this beautiful neckline, which I really like. Soft, highish up neckline, balloon sleeves, which I think are stunning. And then it cinches in at the wrist. And it's the back, guys. <gasps> Look at the back. It doesn't really show very well there, but it, it ties up at the back and you kind of got this little cut out. If you had on jeans and this, it's just like the party's in the back, you know? It's like kind of plainish than the party's in the back, but it's not plain because look we've got all the shimmer going on too so this is perfect for like a christmas party christmas work event you've got going on yeah basically the festive season i feel like stock up before it goes the only thing i would say because i'm going to keep it real with you is it's not the softest like sorry it is soft it's not it is soft it's not the 
it's not itch free is what I'm trying to say. If you find a glittery top that isn't itchy, please send it my way because I don't feel like it exists. I feel like most glittery items, they're gonna have an element of itch to them because ultimately it's got like baby tinsel running throughout it, you know. Um, there is a price to pay for wearing like glitter and sparkly things, but for a glittery top, it wasn't that bad. I am someone that suffers really bad with sensitive skin and eczema, um, which is under control, but this would leave me itching so i will be returning this but if you're normal without any skin issues then i would get it because it's really nice the next basics so just a plain white top it's a really nice length because it's not like mega mega cropped but it is slightly cropped which i love this with like a low rise pair of jeans i think it looks so nice this one is stretchy but it's not slinky. So this is the slinky fabric they do. And then this is like the stretchy cotton, very breathable, not see-through. Obviously wear a nude bra underneath, but yeah, not see-through. I love these so much. The neckline, just they're just perfect. Like everyone needs basic long sleeve tops. So I'm very passionate about it because this has been my sort of style forever. And then when I saw it in this shade of gray, I was like, oh my God, it's gorgeous. So I also ordered this one as well. This one again is in that slight cropped, design but not too cropped beautiful shade of gray I'm not sure what shade we'll call this it's almost like a warm gray don't know. it's just beautiful i love this i then got this jumper here in this beautiful beige and this is a chunky knit as you can see big balloon sleeves again which we love um slightly cropped but not too cropped and this is a wrap over cardigan jumper whatever you want to call it and yeah, I think these are really nice. They're just a fun way of wearing knitwear. Just a little bit more exciting than a plain jumper. This was kind of big on me, so maybe I could have gone down to a size small. <laughs> could have gone down to a size small, but it still was fine. Like I just needed to tighten it up a fair amount to get it to kind of fit. Next, we have this big old jumper. This is a lovely cable knit jumper in this beautiful creamy shade kind of oatmeal-y cream, very light. It's got this cable knit detailing, which also runs down the arms, which I think looks really beautiful. The back of it is like just kind of almost ribbed sort of stitching. And this with a pair of leggings, with a pair of jeans, with a pair of leather leggings, like the ones I showed you, is just a really cozy, comfortable look. Really, really thick, really soft. And I love the length of this one because it does cover your bum. So yeah, a really perfect length. The last, well, this is not the last item. There's one more item, but yeah, the last clothing item is this little baby right here. And I've got a funny story about this. Talk about law of attraction because I ordered this. I didn't think anything of it. I just ordered it, okay? I just thought, oh, that might look cute. I like Paris, it will look cute. And maybe it was a subconscious thing because a few weeks back, I was thinking to myself, oh, like it'd be quite nice to go back to Paris soon. You can see where we're going with this. Anyway, I ordered this, completely forgot, like my H&M order was on its way. I couldn't even remember what I ordered, to be honest with you, because I've been on online shopaholic the last few weeks. So your girl's been ordering quite a lot of stuff. And anyway, me and my friends were gonna go to London for a content trip and we priced it up and London is spenny. So I just randomly said to her, how do you feel about going to Paris? And she was like, oh my God, I was thinking the same thing, but I didn't wanna ask because you know, I didn't think you'd wanna go, blah, blah, blah. Basically we're going to Paris the same day we book it. I open my H&M parcel and bam, Paris is staring me in the face. So yeah, a little story about this jumper. This one's like a medium shade of gray. You've got obviously the Paris on the front, which is in just an off-white ivory sort of color. It's a chunky knit, short-ish in the body. You've got balloon sleeves. I thought this would just be cute. You know, it's sometimes nice to have like a city on them. Will I be going to Paris wearing this like a tourist? No, we will not be doing that. We will be going to Paris looking fashionable. That's what we're trying to do. We're going with the Pinterest girl vibes. <laughs> yeah, I thought this was a cute jumper. It's not the softest. It's not itchy by any means, but it's not like a really soft knit, just to give you the heads up if you are considering buying her. Okay, this really is the last item. So I ordered these boots. I got them in a size six. I am a five because I thought to myself, if I get a six, hopefully the calf bits will be bigger. Now, guys, like, my calves are really not that big. Now, I'm not saying I've got small calves because I clearly haven't, but my calves are not calves you would look at and think, wow, her calves are big. So please tell me why normal boots like this 
are just so freaking tight. Like I have had to buy myself a pair of like wide calf boots um, because I just, yeah, these are not built for legs that have a bit of meat on them, which is so frustrating because I love these boots. They're such a beautiful color. Like how unreal are these? They're so nice. I love that they've got this dark brown on the bottom with like the wood effect heel. They're so soft, they're suede -y. I love them, but they just don't look good on me. Like I'm not walking around with boots that are just suffocating my legs. It's not happening. So these are gonna be returned sadly, but yeah, shops need to do better because it's a hard life out here for any anyone that has a bit of meat on their calves. Makes me sad. Anyways, guys, that is the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching. I am just, yeah, really impressed with H&M at the minute. And I'll probably keep bringing you hauls for as long as I'm impressed with them, which is probably going to be all the time. So I actually do not have a order on its way, which is quite groundbreaking because we've had H&M orders rocking up every single week for the last month or so. But yeah, I think I might take a week or so break from ordering just because give them a little bit of time to catch up and you know drop some new stock and then I'm sure we'll be back. But yeah, I really hope you enjoyed watching. If you want to buy anything, links are down below for you and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye guys.